What's going on, everybody? It's Big E back here with you. Welcome back to the Misty Mountain Gaming Channel. Hey there. That's uh, Beard Fist. We're hanging out in Freak Town, which is a uh, goblin town, uh, which is Everlook. That's right. And this episode, I picked up a quest here for a quest I feel like we should have already had. Uh, we just need some... What do we need? To this. This. Uncracked chill wind, wind horns. We get these from the the flying freaks. Yeah, the chimera, whatever they're called. Let's um, tell you what. Let's come up to the north here, or go up to the north, and we might be able to also get some of these moon touched. Owl beasts. Hope everybody's doing well today. How are you doing, Biggie? I'm doing all right. Today is Christmas Day for me. That's right. And I'm having a little cup of coffee. I slept pretty well last night. I have no plans today. But knowing me, like I'm crazy, I might go to the gym. It's open 24 sevens, 24 seven even. Who knows what's gonna happen? I don't know. I had a wonderful Christmas Eve dinner last night with my friend Christina. It was wonderful. We had snow crab legs. We had amazing uh, steak. So good. Mashed potatoes. And the mashed potatoes had like cream cheese, butter stuff in it. Just delicious. There were green beans with like bacon mixed in. There was salad. There were these... It was, like, all well, mostly seafood. Like, surf and turf Christmas dinner. It was just uh, fucking delicious. I got a bunch of leftovers. There was shrimp as well. Oh, oh, let me... These are level 59 here. Let me be a little bit more careful. We exchanged a few presents. Listened to music. Went for a walk. It was almost a full moon Went for a walk around the town. Well, not around the town, but like our little neighborhood and surrounding area here. It's a little botanical garden she showed me. She's an avid hiker. She's in very good shape. I am not an avid hiker, and I am not in very good shape, cardio-wise. It was wonderful. Let's give the pet. We don't have... We're kind of running low on fish. We have 10 pieces left. Let me put this down here so I can just kind of keep an eye on how many we have. Let's have ourselves a little food buff and a drink. She got me something really nice. A few things. Yes, she did. I'm looking forward to using them. I got her some fairly nice stuff as well. I mean, you know, just stuff I thought she could use. Um, what are we doing here? Be all over this area. There's one. Um... I might have to take out some of these bears. There's a ton of them. Are these dangerous? They are if we attack them. Polar bears. Some of the most dangerous shit ever. Yeah, we do have the bear on us.
Anyway, I'm feeling, you know, I'm feeling okay today. Just kind of melancholy and, you know, I'm not with family or anything. But a couple people sent me messages on Facebook and things like that. It's nice. A couple of my sisters checked in. Some of my aunts replying to people's posts and things like that. I hope you guys have a beautiful Christmas. A lot of people get sad this time of year as well. And that's understandable. Me included. But... I just try to make the best of it. A lot of people don't get sad at all. It's like just a joyful time. You get to see relatives that you don't want to hang out with very long. You know, like 10, 15 minutes with them. It's like, okay, you probably should be heading back to your where you live. <laughs> Leave those gifts and that food you brought, and we'll see you next year. <laughs> um... I wonder if this stuff stays orange because I'm maxed out in skinning here. I wonder if, uh, like, I keep, like, I'm just kind of, lo you're locked here because you, you can't get any more skill, which means the thing you're skinning, I would assume, would never go green, but I don't, I'm not sure. Never thought about it. Where are these owl beasts? Let's roll over here to the east. Did I get both of those? I got one. Right. Look at the bears around here. What kinds of bears around here? The bears. Is he still chasing me? No. The overlapping patterns here. I'm not not digging it. Like, what are you guys doing, man? I think it's Christmas Day and we're two flying freaks. So why don't you mind your own business? Should have put a freezing trap down here. What does he do there? Oh, boy. That's not too bad. Are we going to have three on us here? Okay, I've got to do this. Get him down. i got to get the pet healed up. Which may pull. Yep, it does pull. Disengage. <laughs> May go for another walk with my landlord later. I'm not sure. She probably had enough of me. Get out of here, you filthy tenant. I did all of the dishes for her. I like doing dishes. I do. I mean, it's it's not like I, you know, not like I don't get aroused doing dishes, but I don't know. I've, I've never minded doing them. Especially... We had all four of the, the gas burners on, you know, on the stove and... A lot of things were happening. <laughs> My job was to wash potatoes, peel potatoes, cut them up, cut green beans, stuff like that. I did all the heavy lifting, if you will. <laughs> Probably slap me if you heard me say that. Nope. Come back here. 
And fuck these overlapping patterns. So kind of, I want to keep my eye open. Oh, who is this pimp? What's this guy's name? No, oh, you just went out of range. He's neutral. I mean, he's friendly to us. He's a Tauren, but he is a 60 elite. I think I remember seeing that guy on Mountain or Finn way back when. Cracked horn. Mm -hmm. I wonder what he has. Let's see if we can track him down. Maybe we'll find out. find him. There he is. Artorius, the amiable. That means he's like, uh, agreeable? Amiable? I think you can use that and apply it in a couple of different contexts, right? It's not a. How did I pull this fucking freak? Oh, we didn't. He was just uh, checking us out, I guess. Do 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 do. I kind of want to go see what this guy has to say. There he is. Well, hello there. Small thorium vein. Hey, man. Yeah. Ah, how wonderful to see another person in this remote region of the world. Come, walk with me. Let our bodies keep each other warm. What? What is that all about? <laughs> yeah, I guess he is amiable. I guess that's one context you could use it. Son of a bitch, man. Kind of interested to know, like, what happens if you follow him? Let's go see where he goes. Does he got, like, a little cabin or something? <laughs> Because just walking together is, you're not going to keep each other warm that way. He's like, that's interesting you said that. Pretty strange, man. <laughs> Pretty strange. I'm assuming that is a reference to some person in the real world or situation or something. Come on. Your jaw, huh? War bear leather. Some high level leather working recipe, maybe? My interest is peaked here. I want to see where he goes. 
He just makes the rounds. He just... God damn it. Fucking bears, man. Got a little camp up here, too. I wonder if that's where he's going. Looks like he's heading over there. Let's see what he does. Is he going to stop here? Oh, there's a... What is this? We got Sar Brown Eye, representing Thunder Bluff, and Rylan Howard. A level 20? What is this? How weird. Well, I'll tell you what we're going to have to do. We need to get up in here. Let's put the pet over here. We need you to stay. Just make ourselves comfortable. See if one of them will look over at us. Everybody's just looking forward, pretending like everything's fine. It's not uncomfortable or awkward. Somebody do something. Somebody make a move. Okay, whatever. Yeah, that's quite strange. It's got to serve a purpose, right? I don't understand how, why it's a level 20. That just does, that doesn't make any sense. You can't even RP that. Like, how did he get here? Let me double up. Oh, he made his way in carefully. The fuck he did? He's level 20. He'd fucking be destroyed. I wonder why I'm pulling recently here pulling a lot more lately. And I'm using these lower level arrows as well. Ten kills. Three quest items. Well, Biggie, I'm sure you know it, and it's going to be challenging for you. Yes, I do know this. Okay. Kind of wondering by the time this is released, what is going on with the uh, Aquaphobic Mage Challenge? Because oh my God, have I screwed it up repeatedly! If there's ever a challenge that deserves to be failed, it's that one. It's just it's so bad, so bad. At the top of the world here. There's a rough quest over here, Shiro Tam, I think, which we are probably not going to do. He, that mob has a fear. There's stealthy mobs in the area. It's rough. I don't think I'm going to take a chance and do it. Mm 
I don't think you can tame these. It would look kind of weird because whatever you tame shrinks. Like, it's never the same size as what it is. But these would look just too strange, I think. But it is a beast. Really? Are you kidding me? Yeah, it's kind of weird about the... How it stays orange like that. I do not want a fucking bear on me. Okay, here we go. Good XP in here. Getting 660 plus 330. That is pretty good. So I wonder... I'm thinking internally here, but I'm doing it out loud. Never mind. That doesn't make any sense what I was going to say. Fucking bear. I've never seen so many overlapping mobs before. We're going to have two of these on us. No, we're not. Good. Shira Tam is a is a, a lion, I think. Cat something. Let him get two taunts. And the truth. Get the truth out of him. Oh, okay, so I don't know what I'm thinking. I'm wondering why we've been pulling. These are level 59. He's level 56. That's kind of a thing. Yeah. Just well, I guess I'm just didn't work. These things spank. What? Is this an orange quest? Oh, so there are lower level ones that I could be killing here. Yeah, if we come down here, these are much lower level. Yeah, you can get them off these mobs too, obviously. But it makes me think maybe I need to go back down. Let me go see what the owl beasts are up to. They're moon touched, which means they're like crackheads, probably. Let's see if we can get over there. How many of these do we have? We only need three more, which could be 30 fucking kills. I guess they're up over the hills here, over the hills and far away. Level 57? Let's see what kind of uh, abilities they have here. What a. Viper stamina. Drain that mana. We have Moonfire, as they should. Expecting nothing less. They do have little heals. Hmm. 
Okay, it's not terrible. What should I take? Here's a crazed owl beast. See if he enrages. I imagine he would. Missed it. Damn, I gotta be fucking careful, man. Should we slide off this mountain? area up here. The Hidden Grove. Oh, nice. Oh, we got a little cave over here. This is not the, where I want to be fighting, man. See if we can get down there. Maybe come around this way. Seven twenty six XP off of that one. touched ones. Only the ones that have been touched by the moon. Not these. Can I even get up here? Cold basilisk guy on him. Had shrimp for breakfast. Mm -hmm. I love shrimp. Christina loves shrimp too. There was so much food. Crazy amount of food. At least for me, it was a lot of food. Go see what's in this cave here. It looks like okay, it goes through. You be fucking careful, man. This is like you can't get out of here. And none of this shit is what I need. There's one here. Okay. Let's get this guy. Watch out for patrols. Isn't there a thing in Gadget Sand that you can turn some kind of eggs into or something? It's like a little machine. It's 
some kind of goblin device or gnome device something. I think I'm going to worry about Viper Sting on him. He has like a hot. He could have a regular heal, but... Okay, it's not that big of a deal. Oh, he didn't use it. He did not... Yeah, we're going to go in there. Yes, we are. <laughs> How dare you? Do you mean a feather? No, it's an elegant riding tool. Uh oh, what's happening here? I guess he missed that. He missed his intimidation. Uh, he should. He's three levels below. Not really smart what I'm doing, honestly. But, like, they're not tightly packed in here, so... It's... If we can do stuff like this one-on-one. -on -one, just, I need to be aware of how much mana I have and patrols, really. It's how you would get in trouble here. Or some weird, like, you, you get feared or something, right? Other than that... be kind of hard to get into a bad spot here with just one-on-one -on -one like this. <laughs> Got all kinds of leather. See if we can sell it. Thorium bar, a handful of mithril bars. I was expecting a node to be in here. Disappointed that there's not. I'm not sure I've ever been through this tunnel here. Maybe at some point. By yourself? Looks like you might be. Let's give him some company. Three's company. Come and knock on our door. We've been waiting for you. Yeah, well, Jack Jack Ritter died some time ago. And I think it was Suzanne Summers. It might have been Joyce DeWitt. They're, they were on that show, if you're, like, wondering who the hell I'm talking about. I know Jack... Uh, John is dead. His son is an actor. But I think... It may have been Suzanne who died. I don't know, or Joyce. Suzanne Summers was the blonde on that show called Three's Company, and Joyce DeWitt was the the dark-haired woman. I guess you call that brunette. I don't know. I always was more attracted to the dark-haired. Am I getting Christmas wishes? Let's see what's going down. <laughs> Somebody said they just <laughs> There you go. See if you guys can see this. You see that? 
That's Snoop Dogg and Jesus. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I guess it's some kind of alcohol and something else. I don't know. Nothing goes together better than Snoop Dogg and Jesus. Sure. Do -do 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 -do. I was going to buy beer yesterday. Like during the day for last night, but didn't do it. Because Christina, she enjoys wine on occasion. I can't really do wine. I just, I've never had the, I just never liked the taste. But, you know, it's not like I'm, I have anything against drinking. I just... want to drink alone. Plus, I'd end up getting, like, probably... Like, initially, I'd, pro I'd be like, I'd feel good. That's how it goes. But then I'd take my second sip of beer and I'd be hammered. <laughs> right? And then I'd be a hot mess. How are we doing on time over here? About 40 minutes in. Ice cap. I'm gonna jump on this. Did you see that? How I jumped on that? Try again. Okay. I don't even, I don't even feel like getting up there. How dare you do that? I can tell you what, you stop shooting my fat ass with arrows, and I'll think about not moon firing you. <laughs> How's that sound? That's a good point. It's a fair point. Let's see if we can get the, at least the owls done here. Do them up right. Do them up like they want to be done. <coughs> Excuse me. You guys ever seen a movie? I think it's called Ritual. Pretty good. It's pretty well done. It's about this group of friends. I think it's like four dudes or something. I don't know. They, they go into... They have like an annual camping trip or something. But they go... I can't remember what country they're in. It's one of the... It's a Scandinavian country. I think. I want to... I don't know. It may be Finland or something. I, I don't know, but... It's a um, it's a pretty freaky movie. I recommend it. I'm pretty sur sure it's called Ritual. I'm gonna look it up. Make sure I'm not giving you the name of something different. Yeah, it's called it's called The Ritual. Highly recommend it. It came out in 2017. It's pretty good if you're looking for something kind of different and. A little bit freaky, a little bit spooky. There you go. Owl beast, owl beast spinning around. Look at my owl beast and see what I found.
the only reason I thought of that is because they're these horns on like these weird creatures. It kind of reminded me of that. It doesn't really, like, get going until about halfway through or so. Because, you know, they they set up a dynamic between the friends, you know. Why does my face look weird? Because your face is weird. That's why it looks weird. What kind of stupid question is that? This is not what we need. Do we need four more here? You're so crazy. Look at this shit. It's so weird. I guess that's a patrol. No, it's not. You don't often see this in the game. It's not very common. I mean, there are places definitely where mobs overlap like this, but it's not... Not very often. Which makes this place even more dangerous. Sometimes I wonder if the food buffs are even worth putting up. They... They just don't last. Don't last long enough. You, you really have to stay on top of it. And I'd have to eat at least three times, probably four times, to have a continuous buff to an episode. tell, like, see a difference between the crazed owl beast and these moon-touched ones. Usually there's a subtle difference between the coloring of the mob. But they look the same to me. Would you happen to be... No, you wouldn't happen to be. You wouldn't happen to be. But you are a thing I need. Glenn Johnson, if you're watching, I want to thank you again for your very thoughtful uh, gift. I appreciate it. Oh, the pet is hungry. And... Uh, if you guys are interested... Glenn Johnson, he's a viewer, a subscriber, and member of the channel. He has a new YouTube channel. He's streamed in the past. I think he's new to YouTube. His YouTube channel is called Grand Z-F-E-R. Grand Zephyr. It's all one word. Grand, and then the letter Z-F-E-R. Nothing released yet, but I think something's coming out. I can't wait to see it, man. I'm looking forward to it. Merry Christmas to you and your family. I have some thoughtful people. Yes, I do. Got a little, uh, little Amazon gift card. It's super, super nice. I 
We'll definitely, definitely use that. Oops. I buy my, um... Damn, man. Dude, this place just sucks. I have to feign death here, I think. Fuck, this place is brutal, man. I mean, I probably didn't need to feign death there. Piss off, dude. It wasn't that bad. It wasn't bad as I made it out to be. Are we going to pull the bear now? No. I want to get the hell out of here. We don't really need to be up this uh, this area. I mean, I've known that for the whole episode. Gonna take less chances. <laughs> Pretty sure I said something stupid like that. <laughs> What I need to do is just, um, I need to let him get a couple of taunts and use an intimidation. Because his taunts, and especially his attacks, just, they're not effective on something that's, you know, two, three levels above, especially three levels. Kind of lost focus. I was trying to finish the owls, and now I've switched back over. We need three more horns. Let's see if we can finish the owls, because they have a... Ooh, we just got a green pair of uh, pants right there. A lot of agility on that. Too bad it's cloth. Agility and intellect on a cloth item. Okay. I don't think that would sell. I don't know. You think about the cloth wears. Agility. I mean, it helps with your armor. Let's finish the owls, if I can. And then uh, we're going to get out of here. The Hearthstone is Everlook, and that's where we need to go. There's a crazed... Like a shaman. Well, yeah. Yeah, it does uh, help. Like with your armor, but... I don't think anything else would... It doesn't do much else for a caster. All crazed owl beasts. It's gonna be challenging for you. Here we go. So there's a slight difference. The, the, this, whatever this is, the top half or whatever, looks like it's slightly darker. No, they look exactly the same. The horn's different. Feathers are the same. I can't tell the difference at all. got a heal right as he died. This uh, should be it, because this is 12, and then this will be 13 right over here. Because this hasn't caught up to us yet, because we're in combat. Get this last one. The morning door uh, glory do. Morning dory glue. Get stunned. Real stunned.
Congratulations. Thanks. Let's get out of here. Man, should I just complete this? We only need three more, and I kind of don't... I'll tell you what. We'll get them out here. It's too risky up here. This is the play I should have made anyway. We finish this. We'll get these lower level freaks out there. How am I doing on... Oh, we're okay on water and stuff. This doesn't get turned in here naturally. <laughs> Where does it get turned in? I forgot about this uh, Moonglade thing. That's where it gets turned in? It is. Alright. Um, I guess we could fly there. Let's take a do a quick repair. Oh, congratulations. Congratulations to uh, therapy time. I'm all about some therapy time. What's up? I've got a bunch of junk for you. I don't think these are going to sell. I can vendor them for uh, gold 67, so I'm just going to do it. I'm going to give the pet this meat. That stamina thing we will keep. Let's see if any of this sells. You anything good? Nope. He doesn't. Mm -hmm. Right back! Doo -doo -doo. Well... Do I want to go turn in this quest? I kind of do. Let's go do it. See if there's like a follow-up or something. We're rolling up on an hour. Make it right about an hour. Exactly. Where would you like to fly to? Well, I tell you, I'd like to fly to a Blood Venom uh, post there in Felwood. Dabu. We get anything for this? That's all I'm interested in. I don't see anything. Wait. Um, yeah. No. I'll try again. I get a 90 silver. Sure. And some XP. I'm already feeling like I could take a nap. It's just because I'm sitting here like a bump on a log. <sighs> kind of want to take the day off from the gym. Today would be a shoulder workout. Gotta keep your shoulders wide, bros. <laughs> I wonder if there'd be anybody in there. Probably not. <laughs> it's Christmas Day. <laughs> so the other night, it was the night before last, Christmas Eve Eve. Um, I had to go out to the car for something. This was like one o'clock in the morning. <laughs> my reading glasses had broke, and I keep a spare pair in the console and my little in the car out there. Yeah. So I went out to get them, and when I went outside, of course, it's dead still. It's like 1, 1.30 in the morning. There were coyotes howling off to the west of me, which there's like low foothills and stuff. It runs way up into the, the, the National Forest, or the Gila National Forest here. Um, it's... I. If you've never heard coyotes before, it is really eerie. I've talked about this on the channel before. I'd never heard coyotes until I moved here to New Mexico. The first time I heard them, I was in Santa Fe. And uh, this is when I was with Karen. And that night, I was down on the couch. I couldn't sleep. And when I can't sleep, you know, I don't want to be tossing and turning and keeping her awake. So I just went down. And I was just kind of on the couch. Not watching TV or anything, just laying there. And I heard what sounded like demon children crying or witches laughing. It is really 
unusual to hear. It's not like a hyena. It's you can like YouTube and I guess. And they have different pitches and different ways that they Well, I don't know what they're doing. <laughs> But it is quite spooky to hear in the middle of the fucking night. I'll tell you that if you've never heard it before. Anyway, it's just it's a, it's cool to realize like how close I am to. I sense that you are enjoying your work, life like and that. I believe that we are onto something here. Runners have returned from Winter Spring with reports that there is a series of small caves in the southern area of Winter. Dude, are you kidding me, man? Blizzard, why the fuck don't you give these at the same time? <laughs> For the Horde! So these are the ones we were, you know, not killing. Alright, well this is not a place of rest, unfortunately. Which isn't that big of a deal. What I'm gonna do... Are we close to anything here? I'm gonna fly to Ogrimmar. Where would you like to fly to? Ogrimmar. Straight. Uh, see if I can get rid of some more stuff. If I can't, if the stuff doesn't sell this time around, I'll probably just vendor it uh, to clear up the bag space. But that'll do it for this episode. Thanks so much for hanging out. Enjoy what's left of your holiday. And you got the new year coming up. I guess that's exciting. A beer fist and I will catch you in tomorrow's episode. Smell you later. Peace. <laughs>